would just like to thank everybody for taking time out to attend this knowledge um, exchange event, um, especially all our speakers for all their rich insights. And, you know, whilst I was been listening to all the um, presentations today, there were certain themes that were coming out in regards to responsibility, which I just made a note of. Um, and, and, you know, there was a lot of talk about complexity, you know, none of these solutions are simple to addressing sort of plastic packaging. And we heard that both from Ian at the start of the morning and then the Coca-Cola debate um, moving on. Uh, but I did think, however, how heartening it was to hear how many people are trying to resolve these issues and coming together. And I think then when we moved on to these sort of pre-consumption, consumption and post-consumption, there was this um, ongoing narrative of the importance of collaboration and getting the right voices and stakeholders in the room. And, you know, this was, for me, was really emphasized with Paul, Gonzalez, Caroline and Hervé when they were talking. Um, another theme that came through was, you know, this, this idea of choice, you know, understanding sort of the meanings around how we make choices you know, how to create informative choice um, and recognizing what choices are and aren't available to different um, groups of people. And then finally, um, what really did come across too was this need for interdisciplinarity. And I think what was great today was hearing all the different um, insights from our project and from our speakers from all the different disciplines, you know, marketing, um, you know, supply chain, organization studies, and also sort of the input from our um, practitioners too. Maria, is there anything you would like to No, add? I think no, I th you've captured it very well. I think, I think one of the things that's the interdisciplinarity is needed, but it also reminds us of the challenges because we get into challenging each other's and, and there were some very difficult and complex questions posed today that there are not easy answers to. And that's for us to continue to think about and we'll continue to pick up through our other knowledge exchange events. So again, I just want to reiterate the, the gratitude that we have to you all for coming today, giving of your time and your energy, because it has been really great contributions. And um, Alison and I also want to um, thank the team at LUMS who've supported us because it's been behind the scenes a lot of support going on, Marta helping with all the administration, but also the wider university and school. So we want to thank them for that. And of course, the project team. So, um, Alison, did you want to do a feedback? We have one final ask of everybody um, where we'd like you to um, complete one question on Mentimeter. I'm just um, going to um, share my screen and make it live um, so I can show you. Right. Can everybody see my screen? What we'd like to ask from everybody today is um, for today's event, what is it? What was your main takeaway about plastic packaging? We'd really love to know. And the way you can give that feedback is to go to www.menti.com and then type in the code 61640380. And we'll put those details in the chat too. And it's really easy to do in terms of accessing that because even I've managed it, which is quite <laughs> Right. Alison, is there anything else you want to say about we're going to follow on with an email to everybody? Um, yes, yeah. I'm sorry, I've just um, can you all see the screen still? Sorry. Yeah. Got too many things up. Um, yes, yeah, so after the event, then we will write to everybody to follow up and um explore your thoughts further. Um, and the only other thing I think there is to left to say is again a real big thank you for giving your time up. And a really big thank you to Ian, Amy, Paul, Gonzalez, Caroline, Hervé, Savita, Charlotte and Matteo for their fabulous presentations and input today. 
And as Maria said, thanks for all your energy too. Thank you. And keep in touch with us, please. Thanks, everybody.